pick the object which you want the camera to track. I'm going to use this marble. And if you're using a physics simulation like I am, you want to turn the physics simulation into keyframes. You want to make sure you have two copies of your object. So I'm going to shift D to duplicate this. And now the trick that's going to make all this possible is that we're going to grab this marble forwards in time. So we're going to zoom into our frame range, press A, and these are all orange. And now you can press G. So we're going to move it five frames, but you want to move it five frames back in time. So press minus. And you can see there are two copies of the same marble, but one of them is forwards in time compared to the first one. Okay, let's go to our current camera by pressing zero. We'll add a constraint, copy location, and we want to copy the location of the first sphere. And now add a track to, and we're going to track to the second marble. We now have this camera. It's going to point in the direction you're moving. 